Hi guys, welcome to rm24.com YouTube channel. Name is Vadim, it is my brief introduction, as always. And today we are going to disassemble the smartphone Huawei Y9s. There is one curious thing. The smartphone has the tech number SDKL21, the same number as for model Huawei Y9 Prime 2019. I guess it's because the sanctions have been imposed on the manufacturer. Just keep it in mind. Anyway, the disassembly has the two gears in our difficulty rating or medium and will be disassembled by detaching the back cover glue with adhesive. So we have to use a heating mat or heating gun to soften the adhesive base. And if you guys are ready, let's get started. Okay, our first step will be we should heat the surface of the back cover up to 70 Celsius degree or 158 degree Fahrenheit and we can start to open the back cover. We use a um, plastic film, not too thick, not too thin and put into the space far corner from the cameras and spray some isopropyl alcohol and move the plastic film along the edges the isopropyl alcohol help us to soften the adhesive base so we can spray some alcohol more and continue to move the plastic film I see a lot of plastic tools on sale on Amazon, Aliexpress so I guess you can buy the tools like that or you can use like we do the plastic film protective for a new displays we cut it into the pieces and use it for our purpose purposes we open usually we open with them uh, back covers or uh, display models and yeah, we can spray some more isopropyl alcohol and continue to move the, the tool I call it tool you can call it like a film Always guys be, be careful at the place where the camera is located, there are always the, uh, some space not, you shouldn't uh, put the plastic tool too deep inside, there is no much place to move the our tool and we try to avoid any damage and always try to do our job carefully moving don't try to put or push the plastic tool deep inside carefully carefully try to open the back cover okay we open the back cover on the back cover I see some some gasket and some glue. Now, yeah, we catch the the coaxial cable, but we put it on its place. Some 
some leather. Now we should unscrew all screws and disconnect the battery connector. So we should use a screwdriver cross head 1.5 millimeters or hash 3.0 and we unscrew our screws carefully remember the, the place where the uh, screw screws are located uh, if um, you see that one or a few screws um, may may have different shape on length remember its location also I see a warranty sticker on one screw so I guess the smartphone has not been disassembled before us just guessing maybe it is not sometimes the people uh, can able to uh, unstick the warranty sticker and put it back in un unharm I guess okay guys also remember when you open the when we try to open the back core you should remember that at this place there is a few cables for the fingerprint sensor and for side buttons cable so when I told you do not push the any tools deep inside it's because they are on one side the coaxial cable on other side the side buttons and fingerprint sensor cable so when we do something carelessly we may damage cable um, okay now we should disconnect the battery connector we use a non-metal tool or plastic tool and now one screw I'll screw at the bottom or at the lower part of this smartphone usually uh, these screws are secure the secure in the loudspeaker and the subboard so we use the same screwdriver Philips 1.5 millimeters and carve carefully remove yeah specialist took the tweezers try to remove the screws and after that he I guess he will try to pry over the edges yeah like now and the cover fly away <laughs> okay that was just a core and now we should disconnect connectors and remove the loudspeaker okay now we especially spray over the edges carefully and try to remove the loudspeaker yeah has spring contacts on the contact pad on the subboard. We disconnect the interboard cable connector, connector, and coaxial cable connector. Now we can put the coaxial cable on its place, and now we remove the subboard that is head. Head, head jack, headphone jack, jack port, uh, microphone, 
charging fort for charging and data transfer. Okay, on the in the display model frame still the vibration motor. Okay, we're going to on the motherboard disconnect the interport cable, uh, side buttons cable connectors, uh, display model cable connector, coaxial cable connector. Yeah, there is a lot of cables and now we should unscrew few screws securing the the motherboard and securing the module of front selfie camera the type of the front selfie camera here is i guess it's pop-up camera Okay, we remove the bracket, securing the cable, disconnect the front selfie camera cable. Yeah. And now we should. Oh, we have to uh, remove the card tray. We forgot it. We forgot to do this earlier. I guess it should be our first step. We should uh, remove the card tray because if we will not remove the card card tray, we can able to remove the motherboard. So we remove the tray. Now we can, I guess, disconnect connectors and remove three rear cameras or remove the motherboard okay yeah we can remove the rear cameras okay pray look we are looking for the some clips the motherboard attached and some places so we should find it and carefully detach it and remove it so the specialist pride carefully look for a, for its places their places and I guess yeah he found it remember where the clips are located this clip okay and now we can remove the motherboard so I guess now we're done and now we're done thank you for watching Okay guys, now we're done. Thank you for watching. If you like our videos, please consider subscribing to our channel. By the way, YouTube gave us a um, super thanks button. It's kind of donation. If you can, if you want, please just press the button and it will happen next. Anyway, thank you for watching again. Take care of yourself and until the next video.